One of the ways we can keep ourselves and our families safe during this time is to reduce our trips to the grocery store. Today I wanted to share a food preservation tip that will give us quick and convenient access to some of our favorite vegetables for the next week, month, who really knows how long. Today, we're blanching. First, prepare your vegetables in the way that you'll want to use them for future recipes. In my case, I've diced some carrots and celery, which I typically use for soups and sauces. In a pot of boiling water, add the vegetables. Cooking times will vary depending on the type of vegetable that you are preparing and also how big you chop them. Diced carrots and celery will take three minutes, while a softer vegetable like asparagus will take two minutes. I've linked a handy vegetable cooking chart in the description below, which lists the blanching and cooking times for most vegetables. It even lists some vegetables that are not recommended for blanching like mushrooms. Once you've blanched your vegetables, submerge them in ice cold water just to halt the cooking process. Once the vegetables are cooled, drain, strain, pat them dry, and I like to separate them onto a baking tray before freezing. Once they're frozen, transfer them into a container or a resealable freezer bag. When we boil our vegetables, some of the flavor and nutrients will be lost, but it's important to remember this is more about preservation than anything else. 